Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I'm back. So, if you guys didn't just see that really cool intro in the beginning of this video, all shout outs to Retro Gamer. Such a special reward to have on my video. Thank you. So, today, this evening, I'm going to show you how I finish my paintings with varnish. Um, it's just a simple way that I do this. Um, I have all thanks to Sherry's life to give this to. Um, appreciation. I miss her. Hi, Sherry. All right, so I'll take a syringe. I just got this at the dollar store. And I take Minowax Polycrylic. And I will do my measurements. Sherry said that that's the most important, so I remember that. And I always go by 10 milliliters. And so I just take this. Oops. Let's try that again. I take this up to 10 milliliters. Sometimes there's air in it. Let's see. Oop. About there. And then I will put it in a bowl. Just like so. I'll remove this and I'm going to bring you guys back so that you guys can see what I'm doing. Um, and then I'll take just water, bottle water. And so I do a mixture of 70% polycrylic and 30% water. So if I'm doing 10 milliliters of polycrylic, I will do 3 milliliters of water. Okay, like so. And then I'll smush it in there. Set that aside. Get my popsicle stick. And just stir it all up. I won't stir too aggressively. I don't want too many air bubbles, but not that I don't think that really matters. I don't know. But it just doesn't need to be stirred too bad. Like, it doesn't need to be stirred like paint. All right. Set this aside for a minute. I'm going to cover up this. Alright. Loud noise warning. I gotta hammer this on. Close your ears. Okay. Now, I could have done that after the video, but I will forget. And I don't want to waste that. Alright, so now that we have that done, I'll just take a white cloth, old white cotton cloth, and I'll fold it around and hold it to, I know that this sounds weird or petty, but to a position that is most comfortable for me. I do have small hands, so I can't really like fold it any cool way that I've seen other people do it. Because it just doesn't work out for me. It's weird. So I guess I'm just going to do this on this one, since this is just a, um, it's not a practice canvas, but it's just one. And then I might um, touch another one up over there. So then I'll take this and I'll just dab it in. I'll get a good amount and I will scrape a little bit off so that it doesn't drip drip. And I'm going to set you guys back again. I don't really have my angles right today. Okay. And then I'll just rub that on there. As you can see, it's getting shiny. Um, and then I will I will repeat this same method um, depending on the cam ooh, depending on the canvas, depending on the thickness of paint that was on it. Um, I might do two to three coats. Sometimes it looks like just one will work, um, but I like to at least do two. And I just take them along the sides, rub that. It is important to let your canvas cure, which means to have the paint dry um, and let it set on there. And I do that for a few weeks. Um, this painting actually has been sitting for months, but I'm doing it now. Yay. And you will get this where 
paint is coming off onto the cloth. That's okay. It's just bleeding. But it's not, like the colors are not bleeding together. See that shine? Cool. So there's a little um, kind of bump right there. How I can do that is I can spray water with a water bottle on the back of this canvas and it'll tighten it up. And that's what you'll want to do for all your canvases. Um, like before you give them as a gift or you mail them off. And then I had worked on this the other day. See that nice shine? I know you guys remember this in a video before. Um, has a little bit of streaks, so um, I'm not going to do it tonight, but I am going to rub the varnish the other way and see what I can do about the streaks. So that's the pretty cool thing about how I finish my paintings. So again, a lovely, lovely, lovely from my heart to Retro Gamer. Thank you for the intro. Thank you for the thumbnail. I love it. Thank you so much. And I will see you guys soon. Bye.